that's a fair point, isn't it? Sort of Blair had this sort of media mayhem around him. Even Ed Miliband had the Millie Bay movement. Is there anything equivalent for Keir Starmer? Does he excite the Labour base? Uh, yes, of course. I mean, that's what sent volunteers out campaigning up and down the country and also sent volunteers to campaign in places which maybe they weren't used to campaigning. That's been showed up in good results for us, taking back Hartlepool. The, if with this vote share, sorry, not taking back the council because only a third of the seats were up, but if the vote share aggregated across Hartlepool was reflected in the general election, we'd be taking that back the parliamentary seat. We'd be taking back Stoke seats. We'd be taking back... So seats across the board, as you said, Tom, some of them that were voting Brexit. I do think it's but really you know, interesting though, that what Esther's saying and other Tories are saying is, Rishi steadied the ship. Who rocked the ship? Where is the ship? The ship isn't just on the floor of the ocean. I think it's sunk below the ocean floor. It is in the Earth's but core. I think, I think Rishi Sunak I think, but, but, but what we've got to say, obviously, the, the Conservatives You've been in charge a while. winning elections. Everybody, massive win. And you tank in, the economy. Hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Massive win hang on. in 2019. But what we did see, which absolutely changed the dynamics in the last couple of years, has been COVID was locked down. I'm one of the very few MPs who can stand up and say, I saw the cost of living crisis coming if we stayed in lockdown for longer. Now, Boris Johnson should get credit for coming out of lockdown. Labour would have stayed there, it's would have crashed it. That. Yes, it is. No, that's not true. Labour voted and would have had it for we longer and harder. Like all the way where... through the crisis. No, 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 Sir Keir did say that the unlocking Absolutely. in the summer, the final unlocking, that big move, Sir Keir Starmer did warn that that could create a fourth wave that then never materialised. Could, and we did actually have further infections. But actually, it's just not the case that we voted against the government's provisions. We, we, we exercised no, what I thought was for considerable space. That's just not it's the case. And the Labour Party... It is, because I went in the opposition. <laughs> I went through the opposition lo lobby, i.e. against lockdown, and I'm afraid there was no uh, Labour you know people what? there to be seen I by think, the one or two. I think people uh, really and understandably want to move on to hearing the Tories talk about the problems they are facing now, which is a cost-of-living crisis where they can't see how they're going to pay their bills. Never mind save up for a holiday, which, frankly, they deserve. But can I ask and you what you want to do in the, the ship? What would you do where in the cost-of-living? The Tory party put in tens of billions of pounds. We would all I see, all I see from Labour question. actually is more charges on no, those who can least no. afford it with the clean air oh, zones oh, and the on, on. The oil and gas industries can least afford to pay more tax. I don't think They've so. Already. Even this week, even this week, they've been recording even more record profits on, on, on sales that they never expect to be able to charge this much money on. We would be taxing them right now to help spend that money on helping people through the cost of the has in a time done. limited way. Hang no, on. He has, he has massive hang on, he's already the oil and gas companies a right windfall into. tax on With it. Massive loopholes. Significantly put. People of watching you, know that they can't afford to pay their bills. If you still want to have investment from these companies and them not move out the country, you've obviously got to give them a way to do that. But he's put a significant windfall tax on them. With and the rightly so, which I've sort of think, agreed and asked for. I think people watching on. know whether or not they can pay their bills. But you even know, if you've been knocking on as many doors as I have, Esther, that people are saying up and down the country, even people in good jobs who've never had a struggle before, they're saying they do mm. not know how they're going to get to the end of the month or the end of the year. And that's why, and that's not being that's why about you. 40 not, billion has been put into health. Let's, let's move this they're conversation on ever so slightly. And Labour would have locked down and destroyed the, the economy more. To, to the